this is Gary G here at the Coliseum for a fantastic performance by the USC Trojans as they defeated the Idaho Vandals by a score of 59 to 9. Stay tuned for some fantastic interviews to follow. I thought our guys came in really focused tonight, played with great energy. I thought their effort was good. I thought they were into the game. We executed well. You know, we got a couple more penalties than I would have liked. Um, a couple of them are, were you know, penalties that we're going to learn from, especially the one on, on Iman. Um, so all in all, I was just proud of our effort, that we came out with, with a good fire about us and, and jumped on them. Um, which is probably what we should have done. And, and that's exactly what excited me, that our guys were able to do that. I thought it was great for us and for the team morale that every eligible player got in tonight and got able to play in the game tonight. I think it's great for our team. It's great for our locker room. Um, it's exciting to see Juju was excited, probably on his touchdown as he is, that Dave Melstrom's catching a pass or, or Yofi's in the game. And that, that's the type of team that we have. So all in all, it's a great win. We also understand what lies ahead, and that's conference play starting next week against a quality opponent in Stanford. So we've got uh, plenty of stuff to, to clean up, starting with third downs uh, on the offensive side of the ball. So we got stuff to do. Can you talk about Cody's performance tonight? And as well as, I want you to talk about the defense as well. Yeah, I thought Cody was was better tonight, much better tonight than he was last week. I thought he was really decisive in his reads. I thought he was really accurate. You know, I love the fact that we threw the ball deep and he, he put more air on the ball and allowed this guy to run under it and go catch it. Where last week I thought the ball was a little bit flat. Um, and we overthrew a couple of our deep balls. So I thought his accuracy down the field was much better. I thought he was decisive in his decision making. You know, he had a couple drops really in there as well. So his accuracy was good. Just thought he had a better week of practice with his feet and in turn led into him playing better. I thought defensively, um, you know, after last week's game, we got, I don't want to say we got pushed around, but we gave up some stuff on the ground. Um, that we're much better, especially in the first half, just stopping the run, negating the run, putting them in some third long situations and getting off the field. Uh, in a perfect world, I would have loved to create you know, some turnovers in the game defensively. Tonight wasn't that game. It was just about being sound, um, getting off the field on third down. You know, and then as the game wore on, you're starting to play everybody. They, they got some dink and dunks on us there. So would have liked for us to have a better series to start the second half defensively. Um, but, but all in all, I, I thought we were sound. We didn't give up any big plays, but for the most part, we kept things in front of us and, and made them earn what they got. Juju, was there something that you got the extra? I just ran my route, you know, what I was told. I worked, we've been working on it since practice this whole week. Uh, I just went out there and executed, and Cody's ball was on the spot. As we came out, uh, executing early in the game, um, we got off the field on third down a lot. Um, so it was good to come out in the first half and do what we did. Um, we we got to finish better in the second half, especially coming out the first drive in the second half. But the first half was, was executed. Anthony, you played against Ronald Jones at practice. Are you surprised at all by what he's doing? No, sir. He runs hard. Um, whenever he gets the ball, he's an explosive guy. He has a lot of juice. and um, He's a young guy, so it's good to see him come out here and get these reps and, and show, show exactly what he's doing in practice. Okay. Does Ronald remind you of anything? Um, I don't, I don't know yet. You know, I, give me a little more time. Um, he is a, he's a unique guy. He's very explosive, but then he has the ability in the open field to open his stride up, and he turns into almost. He goes from an explosive one cut guy in tight quarters to a, open up his stride. You know, almost, you know, like a 200 meter runner in the open field. So, uh, he's unique to me that way. He's longer than than you think too. You get around him. Ronald's got good height. And he's got long arms, long legs. So. Um, I don't know yet. It'd be interesting to kind of continue to watch him. You know, I think he's only has 16 carries now in two games. You know, so um, uh, th but there's a lot there. I mean, he, he it's unfortunate he had the one run called back, uh, but he, he made it the men's forward with with another long run to get down to the to the one uh, and then punch it in in, in tight quarters there. So um, he's he's a neat guy. Um, I'm excited that he's on our team and we'll get to watch him here for the next few years. How impressive was truly SC's uh, team tonight? You know, they're just they're a really good football team. They got all kinds of skilled players on offense. They have a great quarterback. Anytime you have a great quarterback like they do, then that, that makes you very hard to defend. And just like they kept bringing in really good running back after really good running back. And, and then, you know, Juju out there. And, and then they bring number two over from defense. They've got a bunch of playmakers. They're, very, they're a very good football team. Would you say it was because of their multi-dimensional offensive attack against you guys that really, you know, had you on the on the ropes? Yeah, I would say that. You know, I'd say you mix good coaching with good players, and that's hard to defend. 
What about defensively? What was their defensive like? I mean, um, you guys did score nine points. Yeah, we did. And we actually had two drives in the third quarter where I thought we played well, you know, and a drive in the first half. They're just, they're long, they're fast. They do a good job of getting after the quarterback and a good job of changing up their looks. So, uh, you know, they're, they're a very good defense also. What do you take out of this game for your squad? Um, you know, I think you can take out of a couple of those offensive drives our guys can really build on, you know, and, and build confidence on watching those that they can move the ball on them. And, and, and you know, there was two drives in that third quarter. First two drives, we went right down the field, those drives. And I guess that, you know, you got to find a positive, and that would be definitely a positive right there. Thank you, Coach.